Well, it's that time of year we see those severe storms popping up. It usually means a lot of lightning, which of course can be extremely dangerous. Yes, Ari Sarsalari knows that firsthand and has that for us in this week's edition of Weather Geek Wednesday. He's joining us live from Atlanta, hotter than the surface of the sun lightning can get. Yeah, six times hotter than the surface of the sun. And you know, look, I'm a big severe weather guy. I've been storm chasing a lot. I've been around some really close lightning strikes before, okay? But last week, this is actually video of my house, okay? About a, uh, an hour after a storm went through. And that is a big pine tree that got hit by lightning while I was standing right inside the front door. So my wife and I, you can see the U-Haul there. We were actually moving. It was an in-town move. Um, and we were going to get some boxes from Home Depot or Lowe's or whatever it was. And then, you know, we had to drive back during a storm. And as soon as we got home, you know, we had to make the decision, all right, the storm's going on. We're going to get out of the car real quick and get inside the house. Literally less than a minute after we got in the house, the biggest explosion I have ever heard in my life. And I could actually see it through the door. I saw like flaming pieces of bark that were just flying off the tree. So I was like, oh my God, Jen, like that tree literally just got hit by lightning. So we're gonna have to go check it out after the storm uh, moves through. And that's what we found. I mean, I was finding pieces of bark like 50 feet away, just completely torched. It was one of the most insane things I've ever experienced. So the point is, Lightning is serious business, and I seriously have a new appreciation for lightning after this happened the other day. I'm not going to be messing around with it anymore for sure. Okay, so um, let me show you uh, what this looks like when something like this happens. This is video from a little bit. Watch that tree back there little bit ago. This was a year ago, Saratoga Springs, New York. There was a camera that just happened to catch this. Maybe we can run that back one more time. I want you to watch this tree right here, okay? And you'll see the bark literally explode off of it when the lightning hits. Isn't that incredible? I mean, I literally saw that out of the corner of my eye. So uh, this is something that just really goes to show how incredibly dangerous lightning is. Now, I want to briefly just show you how lightning forms, all right? So basically what you've got, you've got ice crystals in the top of a storm. Those are positively charged, so is the ground. And then you get all these little pieces of hail in the mid-levels of the cloud that are negatively charged. So it's that difference between the charges. Eventually you get that discharge, you get the lightning hitting. But, you know, we can go into this stuff as much as we want. The point of this whole thing is, like I said, I've got a new appreciation for lightning after having that happen. It was a humongous explosion. Have you guys ever had like lightning hit something in your yard or anything like that? Isn't it crazy? Nuts. That, yeah. That's got to be kind of, I'd be watching every time I come out of the house from now on, Ari. I mean, I almost died last <laughs> week. It's, it's kind of scary when you think about it, right? <laughs> All right, that that now that you went that way, you went a little dark, Ari. I did, okay. I did, but hey, we're trying to keep <laughs> it real right. here. We appreciate it. Thanks so much.